Boba, come here. Boba, come, Boba. Boba. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. It's Karen time, baby. This should be a TV show. Can I get a TV show, please? I can see it now. Megasus rates Karen. This is my name in the spotlight. Just kidding, I'm a YouTube frog. <laughs> Anyways, today we're looking at a common Karen. This one's like a Bidoof or, or a Zigzagoon, right? Just absolutely everywhere and nobody wants you. This Karen is so common. I think she's been in like six separate viral videos and all for being a Karen in six different ways. But I had to look at this this clip in particular because this one's a little different than the rest. What's special about this clip is that she's actually right in the situation, right? She, she approaches some people and she's like, put your dog on a leash. For the first time, she actually has a point in the situation, a Karen dub, okay? This is so incredibly uncommon. You're like, wow. Like, I don't know about you, I've never seen a Karen actually have a valid point. But then obviously, the nature of the Karen is to, is to never stop, right? You keep going. Yeah, she really ruins the whole thing by trying to get a dog run over. Yeah, this one's very wild. Smash like if you enjoy it, let's begin. Oh, also, we'll be looking at Jesus Karen as well at the end as a, as a little bonus. Have you never heard of a leash in the city? Uh, really? Really? Okay, we'll wait for the police to clear it up. Go call them. Karen, call Karen, please, Karen, call them. Karen, get your phone now and call the police. Okay, okay, so Karen approaches some strangers, right? And she's like, hey, your, your dog's not on a leash. Valid point, okay? I gotta side with the Karen here for the first time in, in centuries. I'm not too sure what city this is. I'm pretty sure it's New York. And if it is, that is a very busy place with a lot of cars and a lot of people and a lot of strangers walking around. Now, take what I say with a grain of salt because I'm not a dog owner, okay? I don't know anything about dogs or having a pet. So forgive me if my takes are completely garbage you can criticize me in the comments and i'll change my opinion okay but just thinking about it a little logically right okay so dogs are animals i don't know if that's a controversial take bro they don't have a human brain okay i'm, I'm just saying your dog might be the best guy in the entire world you absolutely love him but you don't know how they're going to react to a complete stranger or to outside noises on the road or colorful bright colored objects stuff like that listen if your dog is well trained i applaud you okay good Good job. But also, for the safety of strangers and your own dog, you probably want to keep it on a leash. But okay, let's get to the Karen, right? Would I call the police on you? No. But let's see what Karen does to handle the situation. Just waiting for him to come by. And which country should I go back to, Karen? Huh? Say it. Now you, now you cat, cat got your oh, tongue? Can I get my tongue? Oh, yeah. Really? Yeah. Edit it out. Go ahead, edit. Edit what out? Come on, puppy! What about, no, come say on. Okay, okay, so dial that back a bit, right? You you might be like, why is this guy saying, oh, well, well, I should go back to my country or something? Well, apparently, this Karen, as I said, has been in previous viral videos, right? And she's apparently appeared for being racist before. So this guy's instigating her, saying that, oh, okay, are you gonna be racist again? So despite this being a completely random interaction, this guy actually knows this Karen from before. She's that famous. Cat got your tongue? Cat got my tongue? Oh, yeah. Really? Yeah. Edit it out. Okay, I don't know what edit it out means. She seems like very confident. I don't know if she was just gonna like drop the n-word or something and be like edit it out. <laughs> I, I don't know what like th there's no reason to even say that. That just makes you sound very weird. Hey buddy, I'm gonna drop 50 slurs on your face. You better edit this out. <laughs> There is no excuse for this. This is completely and utterly unhinged. She runs onto the road, signaling the dog to follow her. And listen, okay, I get it, right? You're, you're trying to prove a point. She's basically saying, okay, this is why your dog should be on a leash because I can literally lead him onto oncoming traffic. Now, are regular humans actually this completely cuckoo insane? No. But, okay, you have a point. And you'll see later that she actually does prove her point because the dog actually does follow her. So, yeah, that's why your dog should be on a leash. Like, think about it, right? If a random stranger Karen can take your dog and literally lead it onto oncoming traffic, then how severely irresponsible are you, right? Because by not putting it on a leash, not only are you risking the safety of random strangers and stuff, or, or I don't know, the driver who might hit a dog. <laughs> Once again, I'm not a pet owner, so I don't know why people don't use a leash maybe it's uh annoying or something or maybe it's like inhuman to put it on a leash but this is how it is bro they don't have human brains that's how you gotta it's just the nature of the relationship and it's for their own safety do you 
you have, lady. Like, serious, put it out there. Put it out there that you can walk around without your dog on a leash. You know what? Put it out there that you can insult someone of Asian descent and then also and then also try instigate instigate a dog to go in the middle of the street because you're on Okay, so she had a viral video of her being racist to Asians, which is why uh, that person made that comment. And apparently she's a principal of, of some school. That That's news to me. I mean, she definitely looks like one. Okay, principal Karens are pretty common. But wow, I think she's just proud of herself. Look at her. She's just laughing. She's like, wow, I'm so famous. These people recognize me. Also, can I just say how weird that walk is? Just like... You're on the highway and you walk like this, just like, yeah, oh, uh, don't, don't mind me, guys. I was, I was just trying to get a dog run over. <laughs> like, what are you doing? <laughs> okay, so this is the part where I want to see what happens after. She leads the dog and the dog actually follows her. Boba, come here. Boba, come Boba. Boba. Come here. All right, so a little question. What what happens after this? Like, what was her game plan? Step one, I got the dog in the middle of the road. Step two, uh, let me get it run over. Like, what kind of a lunatic do you have to be? Let's be real. You couldn't just take the dub. You had one valid point and you couldn't take it. You just lost your mind. Also, I'm just gonna throw out punches in both directions here. Listen, shame on the dog owners, okay? If your dog can be led away by a psychotic Karen so easily, don't you think it should be on a leash? Listen, I don't know how far this Karen actually went, right? Like, did she put doggy treats in her pants or something and that's why your dog is chasing after her? I, I, I don't think so. I think it, she was just clapping and the dog was like, oh, noises, okay, L let me let me follow her. But seriously, if you can't see the problem at this point, you're blind. I wish I had footage after this just to see what happens because I'm so curious, okay? The, what happens to Boba? Come on, is the Karen still the principal? I need more footage. Anyways, I would say get a job, Karen, but apparently you have one. Now, now I know why the principal's always missing. They're apparently trying to assassinate dogs. Okay, a little mini freak out for you guys. Basically, this Karen got really mad that some girl was wearing skin colored clothes. So, yeah, she's conducting divine judgment over here. <laughs> oh my gosh, I met my first Karen! Isn't it wonderful how she just has a sign that says, God hates sin? Okay. She just goes around in her truck all day, every day, just holding the sign up there, you know, giving it to them sinners, you know? How much? Are you the mom? Are you the one clapping, it, clapping for her? Yeah. Hey. Yeah. Let's see. I'm such a sinner. <laughs> I'm too exposed. Okay, um, that's the clothes she was wearing. I kind of expected her to be in a swimsuit or something, but those are very normal clothes. I don't really know what the Karen wants. Probably cover from head to toe in like a, a winter jacket. Anyways, that's about it for today. Go watch more videos. Hope you enjoyed. Love you. Bye-bye.